Hello my dear friends, this is a painty cat, my name is Catherine, this is my old watercolor box, still in a nice condition, so today I'm gonna give it away to my daughter, she's an art school student now, and today I got my new box, looking as an old one, isn't it? Yeah, true, I was hunting for absolutely same, this is a white knight 24 professional watercolor set. Here you can see 24 small containers and each color possible to pick one by one at local art store if you're running out of some shades. Some shades have more use so it's just possible to change colors for absolutely same. And for now white nights watercolors only possible to get in a white boxes. Mine kind of antique already. I was really looking for it for a long time because I wanted absolutely same box as I had when I was a kid. You know, it's just a personal taste. So how we're gonna open it? Paper I'm using today. It's a very nice quality. Uh, watercolor paper. Usually all my watercolors I'm doing on this one. We're gonna create samples, so we wanna know how watercolors looking on paper we're gonna to use in the future. Don't throw away these small papers with the samples and the titles. Why it's so important? Because so many yellows can be different yellows. Cadmium lemon, cadmium yellow mill. It's a really different titles and if before especially if before you was working with a small sets with a just one yellow just one with one red can be tricky to remember all shades straight away so we have to create samples and learn different titles and shades one by one in a watercoloring process Let me speed up a little bit and uh, want to let you know the whole process not that fast. Uh, it's taking around 40 minutes because it's 24 small containers. Of course it is. I'm creating two samples on a dry paper, see, and on a wet in wet technique as well. Some colors can look a slightly different so we're trying both ways because in the future again we wanna watch we wanna know how it's looking when I was young when I uh, got my first professional watercolor set I was so proud I was so excited about it I bring it to my art lessons and you know, I just remember how my teacher was angry at me because instead of painting on a lesson for 45 minutes, I was opening my box and sampling. So don't make the same mistake. Don't bring not opened colors to your lessons. Open it before with a pleasure and without any rushing. That's it, this line almost done. I will create two lists of samples, first line and a second line. And all samples with English titles you can find on my Patreon and on a Facebook. Third line, look, I'm picking colors one by one and making gradients. From first to second, second to third, and go and go and go. Why we need to do it? A look in box colors, put it kind of close to each other, right? And sometimes I know it from my experience, from my practice, I know sometimes your brush can accidentally pick up a slightly amount of neighbor color. If 
you don't like how it's looking two colors three colors together neighbor colors on a sampling that's mean you have to change a position on your box so now I'm just creating combinations of neighbors and checking if I'm happy enough with that personally I think white knights really do a good job about placing colors about how it's placed in the box because all mixes of neighbors I pretty much like so I will keep it the same position as it is on my watercolor box next line and the next list it's a blue greens browns and a black same process and look else why it's so important ah by the way i have two blues here on my box because again it's the old ones all new ones have 24 unique colors uh, look at my box now some colors here looking the same right blue maybe violet still visible maybe light green as well but all others looking absolutely black of course it depends from the screen you looking my uh, tutorials and this video but even in a real in a real if you opening box and you checking these colors looking so close isn't it so how it's possible to understand which colors mean what exactly not possible we have to create samples and in the future when you will follow my steps or any other steps these samples will really help into you to find colors with will match those shades that you can see on your screen when you're following tutorials every time when i'm painting i have my samples closer to me because i can check what colors i have maybe what colors i'm lacking on right our white knights have more than 24 colors for now much much more actually and uh, again it's possible to pick up one by one any shade you like and put it in a middle line on your box i'm almost done with my sampling now it's a line of neighbors when i'm checking mixes how it's looking in combination i kind of like it i really think it's in a proper positions now be careful with your box because it's a plastic i like it much more than a metal because it's not that heavy if you drop it sometimes containers can fall out of your box and also with your sample list you can try each color and place it on the same place when it was before photos of my samples with all english titles you can find on my patreon and facebook all links in description box i want to give a really huge hug and my thanks to navira gujral and her adorable daughter thank you very much for inspiring me for this video i really really want to be helpful for you and i hope your new watercolor set will help you to improve watercolor skills and give you a lot of pleasure to paint with it it was a painting cat i wish you all the best